Hi, in this video we are going to see how to install an indicator for Ninja Trader. Let's start with a short introduction. Indicators for Ninja Trader are exported and imported as zip file. This is the standard file format used by Ninja Trader. We are going to show in this short presentation the complete process to install an indicator for Ninja Trader. We will use the footprint indicator as an example. To import and use an indicator with Ninja Trader, you have to follow the steps below. Download the indicator as zip file. Import the indicator within Ninja Trader trading platform. Add the indicator to your chart. Adjust your chart display. Customize settings for your indicator. Let's see an example now. As the first step, you have to download the indicator as a zip file. For this purpose, you should use your browser and go to our product page. www.orderflow-trader.com slash products dot PHP. In this page, our products for Ninja Trader are listed and you can try any product for free. VWAP, Market Profile, Footprint, Tape Reading, Order Book, Market Depth, etc. All products come with a free trial period of at least 30 days. Now go down in the Products page and search for the Footprint Indicator. Then click the link for more information, at the bottom of the screen, to load the Footprint Indicator page. Now go down to the bottom of the page and search for the download section. Click the disk on the left side to start download. Download should start immediately. Download status should display in your browser. On the bottom left side if you are using Chrome browser. After downloading the indicator in the zip file format, you can now import the indicator. Search for tools in the main menu. And then click import, at the bottom of the list. And finally, Ninja Script add-on. The import modal window should now display. Search for the ITC footprint zip file. Select the file. And finally click the open button. A standard warning message of Ninja Trader may display. Just ignore it and click the OK button. The successful import of the indicator should now be confirmed. Now we are going to add a new chart so that we can add the indicator to the chart. First, you have to connect the free continuum data feed for futures. This data feed manages tick data and market depth. Then, we will add a new chart for 6E, which is the future for Euro. For this example, we will use a 10 range chart. You also have to select the tick replay option. Beware that indicators for order flow will not work without this option. If this option is not available then please change the general settings of your trading platform. If required, you can watch the video on how to install Ninja Trader for more details. Ask for 30 days of data to make sure that you have enough data for correct display. Click the OK button to validate your chart settings. You have the chart ready, you can now add the indicator to the chart. Click the right mouse button to display the contextual menu in the chart. Then search for indicators in the list and click the item. The indicators modal window should now display. Search for the ITC footprint indicator in the left panel. Select the indicator. And click the add button. The indicator was added to the list. Finally, click the OK button. The indicator displays in your chart with the default settings. You need to change the horizontal scale of your chart, to reduce the number of bars visible in your display. This way you will be able to see the details of the ask and bid data for each bar. We can see the histogram of the market profile. 
and we also have a display at the bottom of the chart with important information. We are almost ready to trade order flow with the chart. We added the indicator with the default settings. But of course, you can change the settings to adjust the display and options of your indicator. For this purpose, you need to use the contextual menu, right mouse button, and click the indicator's item in the menu. The indicator's modal window should display. And from there you can change the settings of your indicator in the right panel. If you want to remove the blank space on the left of the market profile, then you can set the X offset to zero. You can also add or remove elements of the display. There are many options to set up your indicator. Please refer to the user manual for more details. Click the OK button to finish, and apply the new settings for the indicator. You can see that there is no blank space anymore on the left of the market profile. And you also have more information in the display at the bottom of the chart. These are the changes that we requested in the indicator settings. In this video we installed the footprint indicator. You can install any indicator with the same process. All our indicators can be tested within a free 30 days trial period. No card details will be asked for the free trial period. You just have to download and install the indicator to be able to use it. We give you here the web link of the main products page. Take advantage and enjoy it. This presentation is almost over. We hope that this video was helpful for you. You can give a like to the video. You can also visit our online store where we offer more than 60 high quality indicators for MetaTrader, TradingView and NinjaTrader. Finally, if you have questions then you can contact us over email. We are always here to help. This video is now over. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Receive our latest video updates. New products releases. Special offers. Business opportunities. We also give you links for other videos that might be useful for you. One video on how to install Ninja Trader. And another video on how to get free data feed for Ninja Trader. Thanks for watching this video. Talk to you soon.